Hi guys, it's Steph. Welcome back to my channel. Today we have the Cheesecake Factory. I am so excited. This is one of my favorite restaurants. This is where I go every year on my birthday usually. So good, so good. So I got some new menu items today, which is exciting. So we got the bread, of course. And then I got their mozzarella sticks, which I've never had their mozzarella sticks before. They look delicious though. They're like the, the logs. The logs are usually the ones that have cheese pulls. And then I got these cheeseburger egg rolls. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let me take everything out and then we'll take the lids off. And then they have a new spicy vodka rigatoni pasta. My favorite kind of pasta. So, I usually get the four cheese pasta from Cheesecake, but now that they have vodka pasta, they actually had this for a few months because they did have this on my birthday when I came, but I was in the mood for a burger on my birthday, so that's what I ended up getting. But, wow, look at these cheeseburger egg rolls. And it comes with two dipping sauces. Ooh, these look so delicious. Look at these. They smell so good too. And then we have a cheese sauce and like a ranch sauce. Yum, I cannot wait to try those. I feel like that's gonna be amazing because all of their appetizers are. <laughs> look at the mozzarella logs. These look delicious. So usually my go-to appetizer at Cheesecake Factory is the mac and cheese bites. I just love them so much. Like they definitely have the best mac and cheese bites. Here's the pasta. Mmm. Smells so yummy. So we're gonna do this right and start with an appetizer. Let's try one of these mozzarella sticks. Tip it in the marinara. And we might take a thumbnail too if we have a cheese pool. <laughs> Let's see. Mm. Oh wow, that is some good cheese in here, holy. Mm. I can't believe I've never had these. These are definitely some of the best mozzarella sticks I've had. They're like so juicy. And that's some good cheese. Wow. Mmm. Okay, I'm gonna take a little Snapchat. If you don't have me added on Snapchat, make sure to do so. I post on my stories every day. Let's do a cheese pull. Wow. Mmm. Those are amazing. Okay. Those are so good. Okay, next we have to try these little cheeseburger egg rolls. I cannot wait for these. Ooh, delete. Ooh. <laughs> I'm talking like sloth girl. Hey, Gabby, if you're watching this. So... I'm an hour from Cheesecake Factory. I did not get cheesecake today because I don't have a cooler. Oh my God. Oh uh, wow. I'm gonna make these at home. These would be so fun to make at home with some like wonton wraps. This like mayo-y ranch sauce is delicious. Like the cheese. Cheesecake Factory is amazing. <laughs> and like, it's so worth the drive. And they have such a big menu.
And I feel like sometimes they say places with really big menus like don't have good food. But like they do. Everything I've had has been really good. And I love how big the menu is because like there's so many options. Wow. So they had this cookie dough cheesecake. I'll put a pick. I don't know if it's new or what, but I really wanted to get it. I honestly, so this is like a shopping plaza. It's an hour and 10 minutes away. It's so pretty. So I was gonna do some shopping after this while I'm up here and just walk around because it's very nice weather too. So I don't have a cooler to put like my food and it's really, really hot out today. Oh no. So that's why I didn't get cheesecake. But I honestly might do like an order pickup and get some when I'm leaving. Because their cheesecake is just so good. This sauce right here tastes like Big Mac sauce. And it's so good with this cheese. Mmm. Seriously, 10 out of 10 both of these. I will get these again. Because these are just so different. Wow. Some water, refreshing water in my Stanley cup. Wow, I, I literally need another one of those. Those are so good. This could be like my meal. So I have some questions that you guys asked on my Instagram that I'm gonna be answering. So, do you recommend the milk makeup primer and setting spray for oily skin? Yes, you guys. So I posted on my Snap story not too long ago that I was trying out a new face primer and I love it so much. So it's the milk and I get the matte one, which is like the black bottle. You can find it at Sephora. I don't know if Ulta has it. I'm pretty sure they do, but it's the best primer and setting spray I've ever used. Like, I have very oily skin, and, like, my makeup does not get oily now. And it's so hot out. Like, I would be dripping in oil by now. Definitely recommend. Also, this is a burn on my neck. <laughs> I forgot to mention in my last couple videos, but I've been talking about it on my Snapchat story. It's finally like scabbing off. I hope it doesn't scar, we'll have to see. But yeah, it's a burn from my curling iron. I know, it's so bad. And I've been wearing my hair up every day too. What made you decide to get Hershey and Mochi trained by a trainer? Um, well, I would like to do like show classes with Mochi just because of how smart she is and how energetic. I would be interested in doing something like that. Time to be real. <laughs> just me stuffing my face with appetizers. Cheeseburger egg rolls. When people come over, my dogs jump on them, and I've been trying to train them to not. I really struggle with getting them to learn that. And their nails are so sharp, like, they attack everyone's legs. Like, workers that come over, they just, like, get attacked. We'll eventually stop, but... That, and then also, it's walking. Mochi, Mochi pulls me so hard, like, she's a Doberman. Like, they're each 30 pounds. So it's basically like me pulling like a 60 pound dog. But I love walking them every day. And they just pull me. Mochi mostly. Hershey is okay with that. But I do know the guy from Mochi's breeder. So 
they're, they're going to a good place and they're gonna just know their basic commands so then I can take them out to more public places like public you know parks even lots of restaurants around me you can bring your dogs but how they act now I wouldn't want to bring them but when they come home they'll be able to come with me everywhere and not act crazy but yeah, I've been wanting to do it a while. It just is expensive and I was just holding off. But from the videos I've seen of their progress, I definitely think it's gonna be so worth it. So I'm excited for them to come home and be all proper. <laughs> do you ever plan on getting a cat? I do, I really want a cat. You know, I've been trying to get my mom to get a cat. You guys should all send her like cat, cat memes. Like cute cats on Instagram. She likes my my cousin's cat a lot. She was like, oh, it was just like so sweet. Like it was coming up to me and like rubbing its head on me. And it was like a very social cat. I'm like, yeah, mom, that's how lots of cats are actually. Like, I don't know why there's like a stereotype that cats are just like mean and scary. Like lots of cats are so social and like love to be cuddled and pets and all of that like that's like pretty much all the cats I've met are like that so I'm like yeah mom like you need to get a cat like if you get a kitten or even one from the shelter like it'll love you and like it's not as much work as a dog it's not as needy and you don't have to take it outside and things like that so like I really want her to get a cat I really want her to I feel like I need to just surprise her with one because I don't know if she would like get one herself. Mmm. They were not joking when they said spicy. Ooh. This has some kick. Would you ever try Jamaican food? Are there any Jamaican food restaurants in Ohio? I would love to try Jamaican food. But I don't know of any Jamaican restaurants, honestly. I'll have to look it up, but... I do not know of any. Maybe I'll need to come to Jamaica and try it there. I would love to visit Jamaica. I don't have any more pl trips planned. I did a lot this month, but... I don't have anything else going on. I would love to go to Florida with my mom. We were talking about it. Thoughts on the Barbie movie? It was really cute. I love Margot Robbie. Um, it was super cute, but I thought it was a little bit too long. A little bit too long. Like, the part where he's just like, I'm just Ken, and I'll be a 10. Whatever the song is. Like, it just was, like, going on for so long. <laughs> I'm just very antsy. So, any movie, two hours or longer, I'm, I'm like, I'd r I don't want to watch it. Or I'd, I'd w rather watch it at home and not in the theater. But I just saw Strays, and it's a dog movie. It's kind of like Ted, how, like, the animals are talking. It's very vulgar, lots of bad words. It's hilarious. I was cracking up the whole time. So I definitely recommend seeing that. One of the dog's voices is Will Ferrell. Love him. And then the main voice actor, I forget his name, but he was so funny, too. But it was just a cute movie. Like, it was, like, a, from a dog's perspective. It was just really cute. I definitely recommend it. It is rated R. Did you enjoy Vegas, my dream trip? I loved Vegas. Definitely one of my favorite places. Like, I hear an ice cream truck, I think. That would be so smart if they did drive one through this like little shopping area. My top three favorite states I've been to in the United States, I think, are Oregon. I think Oregon is so beautiful. I like Vegas and oh this butterfly is so pretty 
Wow, it's like the biggest butterfly I've ever seen. I love butterflies. That's why I have them tattooed on me. Um, and I think Colorado is just so gorgeous. I would say those are my favorites. I do love Florida, but I did like Texas too. <laughs> I just like, like everything. <laughs> but no. Vegas, Colorado, and Oregon, I think, were just very, very cool places and like my favorites. This is good. It doesn't really taste like vodka sauce though, honestly. Like, it doesn't taste like the one I make. It tastes like spicy marinara, kind of. Are your feet ticklish? Yes. I get asked that all the time, I'm not sure why, but they're so ticklish. Like when the nail lady does it, I have to like hold in my laughter. My nail lady though, she's the best at doing my toes because she doesn't tickle me as badly. Sometimes I go to like men and they tickle so bad. I don't know what they're doing. I don't know if they're more rough or anything. I don't know. But my girl Anna, she does them like perfectly and like doesn't tickle me. <laughs> so I only go to her. The heart piercing in your ear, where did you get it? I love it. Thank you. It's from the piercing shop. Most piercing shops do have the heart. It's like a pretty common one for that style of piercing, which is the the Daith, I believe, or the Rook. I think it's the Daith, but most shops have it. I've gotten, I got this one like five years ago maybe, or longer. I've never changed it. Ooh, I'm getting full, guys. Ah. Water is so refreshing on a hot day. Did you have alternative, alternative, alternative? Is that how you spell that word? Did you have alternative names for a shamochi that you almost used? <laughs> I did it. Their names I knew like right away and that's what I named them. Yeah, which is crazy. Cause usually people like debate between a few names, but no. As soon as I saw Hershey, I knew her name was gonna be Hershey. And same with Mochi, I named her actually before she even came home. I love that name. I think that name is honestly so cute. If I get a third one, its name will be Meatball. I don't know though because I feel like they, they all end Hershey, Mochi, like they end in the E noise. So I feel like the third one would need to end in an E as well. So they have like a good rhythm. Spaghetti, that ends in an E. Or not an E, but you know the sound. E. Spaghetti. I don't know if I like that for a dog though. <laughs> like I'm talking like I'm getting a third dog. I'm not. But you never know what could happen. <laughs> okay guys, I'm extremely full. I'm going to cut this video off. But that was all so good. The cheeseburger egg rolls were my favorite for today. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you'd like to see more restaurant style videos, let me know where you want to see me go to next. I don't mind driving. But I love you all so much and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye guys.